we're gonna see who can build the best security castle. Whoa, that sounds so cool. I know, Udo. We'll have 10 minutes to build it. So which side do you want to build on? The red side or the green side? Well, Mongo, I'm a turtle and I'm green. So I'm obviously gonna pick the green side. Whatever, Udo. I'm picking red because it's way better. Green is better. And so my castle is gonna be better than yours. No, it isn't. Whatever. I'm gonna start building, Udo. Okay, now let's start building our castle. Let's start out by selecting this block and let's go all the way over here. Let's fly up a little bit. Let's set all this to diamond blocks. Then let's select this block. Go all the way over here. Mine down to select this block. Now let's just set all this to air and boom, the inside of our castle is all hollow. Now let's make the entrance of our castle right here. And this is the real entrance to the house. This time around, we're not gonna have a fake entrance or that's what Wudo probably thinks. We're gonna have another wall inside of our castle. There you go. And once Wudo enters the castle, he's gonna have two doors to choose between. This one right here or this one right here. But both of these are gonna lead to lava. So automatically, Wudo's gonna die two times to our castle. Let's just set this to lava. There you go. And let's also set this side to lava. There you go. Now let's build up some walls so Wudo can't escape from the lava traps. I can't wait to see Wudo's reaction when he has to go through both of these and dies to both of them. And obviously, Wudo won't enter these rooms when he sees lava. So let's get some signs and a painting. Let's put these signs on the wall right here. And afterwards, let's put a painting right on them. And there you go. That should be good enough. And let's also put a sign right here that says choose a door. Pick correctly or you'll die. This is perfect. So Wudo's definitely gonna have to choose one of these doors. And that guarantees that he's gonna die. Wudo definitely won't be expecting these doors. Usually I have really fake entrances. And since these two doors kill him, let's start making the real entrance, which is gonna be all the way over here. We're gonna be using this thing called a ghost block. And if you guys don't know what this is, it's basically a block that copies over another block, but you can walk through it. And if Wudo can figure this door out, I'm gonna have a whole bunch of other traps for him to complete. The traps are gonna get harder and harder as he goes through them. And as soon as Wudo walks through these doors, he's gonna be fighting some mobs. So let's just build some walls right here and some walls right here. Let's also put a roof on this wall. There you go. Now we have a room built for mobs. For this trap, we're gonna need some dispensers, some redstone, some redstone repeaters, some wither skeletons, and of course, some pressure plates. All we have to do is put these dispensers on the wall. Then let's break part of this wall because we're gonna need to route the redstone right here. Let's place the redstone repeaters right behind the dispensers. Then let's connect all the redstone repeaters with redstone. We'll have this redstone go all the way down here. And all we need to do is put the redstone here and the pressure plate right here and boom, all of them activate. Now let's just clean this up a bit so Wudo can't see the redstone contraption. And there you go, perfect. Now as soon as he walks through, all these are gonna activate and they're gonna have wither skeletons inside. Now if I try it out, please work and boom, wither skeletons spawned in. But we're obviously gonna need to give Wudo a weapon because he can't kill these things with his fist. So let's just add some dispensers right here and let's put pressure plates on top of all of them. And inside these dispensers will be a whole lot of diamond swords that Wudo can use to fight the wither skeletons with. This way he actually has a chance to fight them and if he can fight them, he can move on to the next level of the house. But to enter the next room, he's gonna have to go through these iron doors. And to go through them, he's gonna have to find the fake lever. So this item is called the secret lever and what it does is it basically copies over the block but it acts like a lever as you can see. So if we just put this fake lever right here and then let's press it. Look, the iron doors open. Let's also have one right here. So if he wants to open both, he can. So once Wudo figures this out, he can go to the next level, which will consist of some deadly parkour. So let's make a wall from here to all the way over here. Boom, there you go. Now let's just set this whole ground into lava. There you go. So since this parkour is super deadly, we're not gonna be having normal parkour jumps. Instead, we're gonna be using invisible blocks. So if we build right here, as you can see to the normal eye, this block won't even be here. So Wudo's gonna wonder where the first jump is, and if he looks around, he can find it, but it's really hard to see at first glance. So once he jumps here, I'm gonna need him to do another impossible jump all the way over here. There you go. From here, he's gonna have to climb this pillar, which will consist of ladders going all around it. So Wudo's gonna have to jump from here to here and go onto this ladder and walk around it. And once he's here, he's gonna have to make a really hard slime jump. So he's gonna jump here onto the slime jump and go over here, where he will be met with an iron bar. And if you guys didn't know, iron bars are super skinny, so they're really hard to land on because you can easily slip and fall into the lava. So let's see if this jump actually works and boom. But after Wudo gets here, he's gonna be really confused because we're gonna add a sticky piston right 
right here. And this sticky piston is gonna have a diamond block. And then we're gonna use the secret lever from earlier. And we're gonna put it right here. So Wudo's gonna have to find the secret lever. And once he does, he can make the jump onto here. And then from here, Wudo's gonna have to do a crazy jump here. Then we're gonna add another lever jump right here. So after Wudo gets here, he's gonna have to pull the lever and jump onto this block. From there, Wudo's gonna do a simple jump here and another simple jump right here. And obviously, once he makes it here, he basically completed the parkour. So let's try this parkour out for ourselves. This is gonna be super hard, but I think we can do it since we know where all the invisible blocks are and we also know where the sticky pistons are. Boom, there you go, onto the slime block. Now let's just pull the lever right here. Let's jump onto this block. And once we're here, let's pull this lever. Let's jump here and then to here. Okay, we failed that jump, so Widow's gonna have a hard time. Then let's jump here and here and boom, we completed the parkour. Let's just add a roof to the parkour so Wudo can't see whatever else is in the house. Boom, there you go. After Wudo completes the parkour, he's gonna move on to a maze. So let's just build some walls right here and a wall right here. And this right here will be the exit of the maze. So now let's start building the actual thing. We're gonna be using sand blocks for this whole thing. And obviously this won't be any normal type of maze. It's gonna have some dangerous things Wudo will have to overcome like mobs and traps. So let's build our first wall right here and then another one right here. One right here. We'll have one going right here. And for the rest of this maze, let's keep on adding random patterns that don't make sense. Let's add a dead end right here. So when he's walking from here, it looks like there's something over here, but there isn't. What there is gonna be, though, is a zombie spawn egg. And of course, a fake pressure plate. So when Wudo walks here thinking there's gonna be something on this side, he's gonna walk here and the zombie's gonna spawn in. Let's also add another dead end right here. Let's add another dead end right here. And now let's make it so this path just leads to the other one. And there you go. But over here, what we're gonna do is remove these two blocks and add some lava. So Wudo's gonna have to make this jump in order to complete it. And for this final area, let's just make Wudo super confused by having fake lava on the ground. And if you guys don't know what fake lava is, it basically looks like real lava, but when you get inside it, it heals you instead of killing you. So this will definitely freak out Wudo and he won't even know what to do. And boom, our maze is finally complete. For this next part, I'm gonna make Wudo do an ice boat course. If you guys don't know what that is, it's basically when you have a boat and you ride through the ice with it. As you can see, the boat goes really fast when it's on ice. But obviously, this ice course won't be easy at all. We're gonna make sure the entire ground is lava and we're gonna have many obstacles on the course. So let's build a huge wall here and let's build another one right here. Once Wudo gets here, he's gonna have to climb up a few ladders and we're gonna set this entire ground to lava. There you go. Now let's also do this part. Let's select this and come all the way over here. There you go. And let's just finish it off right here and boom, we have a huge pit of lava. So let's start the ice course right here and let's build all the way out here. And once Wudo gets here, let's make it so he has to make a turn to right here. From here, we're gonna make him do another turn right here and another turn right here. So if you couldn't tell, this ice course isn't just gonna be a straight line. It's gonna be a few zigzags. Now let's extend this all the way over here and let's make him do another turn right here. And this is gonna be the last turn for the ice course. Once Wudo gets here, he basically completed the course. So he's gonna move on to the next level. But we're not done with the ice course. Let's go back here and make a few changes. First, I wanna add a few obstacles. So let's just add bits of diamonds around here. And we'll even add a diamond wall right here. Let's just add a few more of these things. This way, Wudo will have a hard time in this ice course, which is exactly what we want because we don't want him to complete it easily. And these are the last few ones. And once he gets here, he basically made it. So let's place the boat and try it out for ourselves. And oh my gosh, this is gonna be super hard. I can't imagine how many tries it's gonna take him to complete this. Even I'm having a hard time completing it and I'm the one that built it. So after Wudo completes the ice course, he's gonna come over here. And once he's here, he's gonna have to decide between two pathways. One way is gonna have lava and we're gonna put a sign right here so the lava doesn't escape. And this other side is gonna have water. So let's just add that in real quick. Not only is it gonna have water, it's gonna have this block called soul sand. And if you guys didn't know, whenever you combine soul sand with water, you go up really fast. And to disguise these two pathways, what we're gonna do is get a painting. Let's just place one right here and let's place the other one right here. Then let's add a sign in the middle that says pick one. So out of these two, he's gonna have to pick one. Obviously, if he goes into the lava one, he dies. And if he goes into the water one, he moves on to the next level. And from there, I want Wudo to come all the way over here. Let's just make a huge floor. This floor isn't gonna be any ordinary type of floor though. It's gonna have a lot of mines. And if you guys don't know what mines do, I'll show you right now. Whenever you walk over a mine, this is the type of explosion it has. The explosion is bigger than TNT and creepers combined. So if Wudo even touches this 
us just a little bit, he's gonna die. So let's make sure we add a bunch of them. We'll add a few row of them right here. Then we'll just add some randomly around here. And at this point, I'm just gonna place them wherever. To be honest, I don't even care about having patterns because I just want Woodrow to die when he gets to this area. And these are the last few ones. Boom, now we're done with our mines. And after Woodrow is done with this part, what he's gonna have to do is go up. So let's start adding some stairs. And if you guys made it this far, comment hashtag diamond. Let's confuse all the other people in the comment section. And there you go. These are the last few stairs. And now that we're up here, let's add a roof to the castle. Boom, there you go. Now let's just break these blocks because Woodrow needs to get on top of the castle. Just when Woodrow gets to the top of the castle, he's gonna realize that it's not over. For this next part of the castle, what we're gonna do is question Woodrow. So inside this room, we're gonna have two options for Woodrow to go through. And he's gonna be asked one simple question. What is Mongo? The two options are gonna be king or just a person. And obviously, we all know the answer. I'm a king. Look at my crown. It's so shiny. So behind the wrong answer, we're gonna have Woodrow explode in TNT. So let's just get some TNT real quick. And let's also get some obsidian. If you guys didn't know, obsidian doesn't actually blow up to TNT. That's why it's so good for these traps. So let's just add this in real quick. Now all we need to do is add some pressure plates on top of the TNT. Then let's just add some signs. And let's put a painting. And on the correct side, we're just gonna put a painting and he can just walk through. And once Woodrow completes this part, he's gonna be done with the castle. And he'll be greeted with a chest that will have emerald blocks because he loves the color green. And the potion of the turtle master since he is a turtle. So let's just put all these things in here. And boom, we're done with our castle. I doubt Woodrow's gonna be able to complete this thing without dying a few times. To make it look more like a castle, let's start adding these bumps on the roof. And boom, our castle is done. Look how good it looks. Hey, Woodrow, time is up. Perfect. My castle's done. Come meet me on my side, Mongo. All right, I'm here, Woodrow. Let me see your castle. Come and take a look at the strongest castle of security that you have ever seen in Minecraft. It is so cool. Why the heck is it made out of dirt, Woodrow? And why isn't the door symmetrical? It's more to the left side than it is to the right. First of all, you know that dirt is the strongest block in Minecraft. And second of all, what are you talking about? It's not straight. Yes, it is. Yeah, well, dirt sucks. It's definitely not the strongest. Diamond is the strongest, Woodrow. Anyways, what does this say? Please enter. Um, Wait, I you, you don't want to enter here. You don't want to enter here, Mongo. It's, it's really bad. Maybe we should go to like another entrance or like try and find something else. I don't think you should go in no, here. No, no, no. It says please enter. It asked nicely. It said please. So I'm entering. Come on, let's go. <gasps> oh no. What is this? Why is there TNT here? What is going on? Okay. Are you serious, bro? What did I tell you? I can't believe I just died to your castle. It's only been 30 seconds. Yup. I told you mine was going to be better. Now go ahead and find the real entrance and start following my directions. Real entrance. Where could it be? It's probably on the side of the house. Okay. Then what's behind here? And oh, um, wait, wait, you're not supposed to see this. Uh, whoopsie. Woodo, you literally forgot to close the secret door. Are you serious? Well, what are you talking about? It's closed. See, you can't see it. There's nothing here. There's nothing here. It's just dirt, Mongo. Well, now I know that it's there, so I'm just gonna open it, Woodo. Nice. Oh, uh, how did I forget? Good job. Nice. And what's this? Well, this is the most difficult lava parkour that I invented myself. So good luck getting across this huge pit of lava. Um, I don't think it's that hard, Woodo. Watch me complete this in two seconds. Boom. And boom. Nope. And nope. boom. And boom. Oh. Nope, nope, nope. Wait, why are you hitting me? That's not fair. What the heck? You're cheating. You cheated. Woodo, you are not allowed to kill me like that. That's not fair. There's no way I can die more than once in this thing. Come on, Woodo. I didn't kill you. It was just my huge turtle fist, okay? <sighs> Whatever. If you kill me again, I'm not playing with you anymore. Come on. I got this. No way. Wait, oh. no way. I just died. <laughs> what? Haha, -ha, Mongo. That's your third death already. I promise I'm not going to die one more time. Come on. I got this. I'm going to complete it really fast and boom. Oh, wow. So I guess you really are good at Minecraft. I am the king of Minecraft, of course. Check out my crown. Yeah, only after three deaths, though. Anyways, Mongo, take a look at this. I want you to answer this question. What is the better block, dirt or diamond? The answer should be pretty obvious. Um, you spelled better wrong, first of all, and the wrong. You need to go back to school, Woodo. Um, and obviously dirt sucks. Diamond is way better. I already told you this. Come on, let's go in here. <gasps> no, uh, are you serious? Uh, That's my fourth death in this castle, and it's made out of dirt. How am I dying to this, Woodo? Well, I guess you just suck. Uh, you should probably pick the right answer, Mongo. <sighs> Whatever. I know the answer is diamond, 
second, but I guess I'll just go into dirt and wow, I was correct. Let's go. Yeah, but you're only correct the second time. Anyways, Mongo, take a look at this. This is one of the hardest parkour jumps ever to exist in Minecraft. There is no way you're going to make it. A three block jump is supposed to be hardwood. Are you serious? Okay, watch this. Boom. B wait, what? How? Uh, I'm the king of Minecraft. That's how. Uh, even I couldn't make that jump when I was doing it. Anyways, enough with that. Let's just see. Uh, open up this chest, Mongo. You're going to need what's inside. A wooden shovel? What are you kidding? enough gave me anything better i can clearly hear the skeletons right there well that is the literally the strongest weapon in the game you didn't know that in the new update shovels are super strong Woodo, it does 2.5 attack damage are you serious right now okay mongo if you want to be like that then just go ahead and fight these skeletons then they're waiting for you oh no what the heck okay 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 let's see let's see billy boy what the heck why is it named that oh no i'm gonna die oh no this is come not on, good bobby get him come on bobby oh no it's bobby toy and billy boy oh no okay there you go oh Oh, I'm gonna hit it and close the door. No way I just died to Billy Boy. Are you serious? Okay, I got it this time. Come on. Come on, Bobby Toy. You're dead. Bobby Toy is dead. That's cool. Where's Billy Boy? Um, I think Billy Boy just jumped off into the void, Mongo. You got lucky this time. I wasn't lucky. He was just so scared of me and my amazing crown. Whatever. What's next, Woodo? Well, welcome to the laser parkour room. These lasers are so hot and they'll zap you instantly if you even step on them. So good luck getting past these because I know you won't. These are literally the easiest jumps of all time. You have two blocks in between them, Woodo. Boop. What? Boop and boop. What? How? These are so hard. I can't even do it myself. Um, because you suck at Minecraft and I don't because I'm the king of Minecraft. Anyways, Mongo, choose one of these to go up. Um, water or lava? Obviously, I'm gonna pick water, Woodo. Come on now. Let's go up this. Wait, wait, I'm dying. What the heck? Why am I dying? What's going on? It looks like you walked into my poisonous water, Mongo. Okay, so you clearly use fake water. I've done this trick before, you know. And this must be fake lava then let me go up this and yup it heals me instead let's go baby i'm so ready for the next challenge come on come on come on come on and uh, wait that's pretty much it mongo that that's was it? uh yeah yeah that's it congrats you beat it though it was super hard wasn't it hard is maybe not the word to use but let's see what's in this chest come on please be something good and it's all yours just just one red wool yeah it's your favorite color you should love that i mean it is my favorite color but Woodo, i feel like i'm spoiling you with my present if you're just gonna give me one red wool Whatever, it doesn't matter. If you can finish my castle, you're gonna get so much better than just one block. Wait, really? Then let's go do that right now. Let's go. All right, Woodo, welcome to the number one castle in the world, aka the Diamond Castle. Whoa, okay, this place is huge. But I hate diamonds. This color is so ugly. Okay, whatever, just go inside already. Oh, okay, so you have a pretty nice entrance for you, Mongo. Thanks for making it so easy. And uh, oh, let's see, choose a door, pick correctly, or you'll die. Oh, Mongo, come on. You know I've done this trick many times before it's obviously the right one right what, 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 what? no Oh, <laughs> you died, Woodo. What the heck? Okay, well, if it wasn't the right one, then it's definitely the left one. And no, what? You again? died again? Are you serious? You fell for the same trick, Woodo. What the heck? Well, if none of these are the right door, Mongo, then which one is? I'm so confused. Okay, you know what? I'll give you a hint, Woodo. Since you died two times already, let's just say the real door is in the end of the hallway. End of the hallway? Okay. Wrong way, Woodo. Wrong way. Fine, I'll go this way then. All right, it's this way, but you have to figure out where the door is. I'm not helping you. Door? But where, what door? There's a door here. Woodo, there's literally a door. You just have to walk through it. I'll give you that no, hint. No, there is literally nothing. What are you talking about? And what, wait a second. Wait, there is? And what's going on here? Why are there withers? Ah! You better fight them, Woodo. You better fight them. More just spawned in. Oh my gosh, Mongo. How am I supposed to kill these things? I'm gonna die. That makes your third death, Woodo. Let's go. Okay, round two, Woodo. You got this. Come on. There's no way. They're too powerful. Haha. <laughs> okay, you know what? I'll help you out. I'll kill some of them for you, okay? You'll be able to fight only like two or three because you suck at minecraft all right we don't fight these three and you'll be fine oh no these things are so strong i don't want to die again oh wait oh wait i got him i got him good job Budo. now you're gonna move on to the next section but you have to figure out a way to get past these iron doors what these things are iron doors though how am i gonna get through without a lever well maybe you should click around Woodo. wait there has to be something around here and wait wait a second are these invisible levers no way you just figured it out that quick how are you that smart come on mongo that was way too easy i know all the tricks you pull on me anyways what's going on in here well this is the most insane parkour in all of history so figure it out and get through it Woodo. figure it out oh i know exactly what this is it's invisible parkour mongo you've done it to me before all i have to do is highlight the outline of the block and jump bro no way you're figuring it out already you're so smart Woodo. oh i'm just gonna hop over here and hop on these ladders 
And boom, there we go. Now I just have to jump on that slime block and jump all the way to those iron bars. This is way too easy. Just go like this and this. Boom. Whoa, I didn't know you were that good at parkour. Now, where's the next thing I need to jump on? Um, wait, there's nothing here, Mongo. How am I supposed to jump? Maybe there's a clue on the wall. That's all I'll say. Clue on the wall. Wait a second. Did you hide something again? Maybe, maybe not. We don't click around. That's all I got to say. Click around. Why do you always do this to me? You have 10 seconds to figure it out, Udo. I'm going to hit you into the lava. But no, don't hit me in. Okay, okay, come on. It has to be somewhere. It has to be somewhere. And oh, Wait a second, I found it. No way you found it. What? There was like three seconds left. Whatever. Just make the jump, Woodo. All righty. Here I go. Now I just need to jump onto here. And okay, Mongo. Really? What What else is hiding here? Another lever? Maybe, Woodo. Click around. Oh, there it is. Now I just jump onto here. You found it that quick? And what? You just hit yourself off. <laughs> For a second, Wudo, I thought you were really good at Minecraft, but you're still the same noob. Uh, no, I'm not. Watch this. No. no! <laughs> you failed the jump. Are you serious? Okay, Wudo, you're dying way too many times, so I'll just leave you there. Come on, you can finish the last two jumps. Come on. Okay, okay, come on. Jump in. No! Are you serious, Wudo? You can't even jump to that block? Okay, I guess I'll help you out and put you there. Come on, this is the easiest jump of all time. You got this. Oh, it's just so hard. Can I really make it in? Okay, I did, I did. Okay, now you're on to the next part of this build, aka the maze. Ooh, the maze. I'm so good at solving mazes. I just have to go in here and... Whoa, whoa, why is there zombies? Why is there zombies? Get away! You're pressing the pressure plate. That's why zombies are spawning in. Oh, uh, you sneaky, sneaky guy. Why would you hide a pressure plate? Well, that's just one of the deadliest traps of this maze. Keep attempting to solve it, Udo. Oh, it doesn't matter what's in this maze, Mongo, because I'm just going to destroy it. Let's see. What else is in through here? Hmm. Okay, I just gotta turn left and left again and left again and uh, nice, just a dun dun. Okay, Mongo. What about through here and again? This maze is so hard. You got this, Wudo. Come on. Okay, what about this and oh, nothing is working. What's inside here? Why is it all lava? Okay, well, you have to get across this lava in order to go to the next part, Wudo. Did you do one of those tricks again where something's invisible or if there's a lever anywhere? Come on, come on. I need to find it. Here, I'll give you a hint, Wudo. I'm gonna hit you into the lava. I'm gonna hit you wait, in. I'm gonna no, hit you no, in. No, don't, 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 you're don't. dead. You're dead. What, wait, wait a second. What, what, what? This isn't real lava? Nope, it's fake lava. Come on, Woodrow. You did the same trick in your castle. Oh, okay. Fine. Whatever. This next part has to be super easy, right? I just gotta go up the super long ladder. And, oh, wait. Is this an ice boat race? Yup. Come on, Woodrow. Hop in the boat. You have literally 60 seconds to complete it. Go, go, go. Uh oh, that lava's gonna make it super hard. Come on. I can't die. Bye. <laughs> you died already, Woodo? Are you serious? Here, I'll spawn you in another boat. You got this. Okay, come on. I'm just gonna go through here and just watch out for this turn. And oh, oh no, 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 no! Woodo, oh impossible. my god! Okay, I'll just put a boat here and let you start here. All right, here I go. Just gotta make this turn. And whoa, 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 whoa no! <laughs> Why do you keep on dying? That's like your 20th death. Oh, 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 oh. Come on, boat. Come on. Don't slip inside. But wait, Mongo, I can't even fit through here. Okay, you know what? I'll break the blocks, but I'll make this easier. I'll break like half of the block for you. Since you're struggling so much, man, I got you. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. No! I broke the blocks and you still died. You're such a noob. It's just so slippery, okay? It's hard to control. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> what? Oh. That's like your 30 million death, Widow. Come on. Okay, come on. It's literally the last stretch. All I gotta do is make it here. And okay, okay, I won. I won. I made it. I made it. Okay, you made it after like dying 10 bazillion times. But here, you have two options, Widow. Pick one. The left or the right side? I don't know, Mongo. I'm feeling some good energy from the right side. You know, this painting is telling me that there's probably some really, really good loot through here. So I'm just going to go inside and oh, it's the same painting, Wudo. Whatever. You pick the right side. So uh, that means you're up here and you have to complete this minefield. Oh, what the heck? This minefield is humongous. Okay. Come on. Please don't explode. And oh, okay. 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 I just got to hop through this and hop through here and here and here. Oh, wait a second, Mongo. You made this too easy. I mean, I just clicked around, Wudo. I hope you died, though. What's going on? How are you completing it that fast? You just make these Gaps way too big, Mongo. That was so easy. Now I'm just gonna go up the staircase. Okay, well, here's the final question for you to answer, Wudo. What is Mongo? You know me. What am I? Am I a king or am I a person? Well, you're a person, obviously. Like, you're literally just a normal Minecraft player like everybody else. No, I'm not. I'm a king. And well, because what? you think I'm a person, you're dead. Good luck, Wudo. No!
Okay, fine. You know what? You are a normal Minecraft player, but you're a king in my heart. So I'm just going to go on the king side and I beat it. Good job, Buddha. Because you beat it, I don't know how you beat it, but you did die a million times. Because you did beat it, you get some prizes. <gasps> what? My favorite color and turtle potions. Let's go. Good job, Buddha. I guess we're both winners. But do you know the viewers can be a winner? By subscribing. That's right. Everyone watching, subscribe and click the video on screen to see more. Bye.